It's mail time. Well, Elin's racing has made my car go even faster. In fact, I think it is, at least in the corner, the same speed as my previous GT3. With speed, the dangers if an accident occurs is unfortunately present. Therefore, Competition Motorsport has uh, provided me with some safety equipment. And that's what the mail time is all about. So we're going to open this box. Ooh, look at the box. It's huge. Well, here it is, ladies and gentlemen. A white roll cage for my safety when I drive my Cayman T. First impression is a solid product, but I actually know that already because I printed the installation manual from the web page. And when you get such a third information that you know it is almost like installing IKEA, I decided to do the work myself just to prove how good engineering this product is. White. White is always white. That's what I've always said when it comes to motorsport color from Porsche. And I decided to have this in white because, well, basically because it will match my car. But um, Competition Motorsport offers this product in various colors. So pay attention, I will link below a link to this particular product with all available colors. Let's go to work. Removing seats, five bolts each. I cannot stress enough how beautiful I think the 918 bucket seats are. Not only beautiful, but they are light. I understand how they actually saves the 11.3 kilos if you select this option. A must-have option if you expect your Cayman T, Spider, GT4, GT3, whatever, every car that has this option. Beautiful. And not only are they beautiful and light, they are also extremely comfortable. I have done rides in several hours in these bucket seats and you one, my friend, has been down to Austria in these bucket seats. They are superb when you do long journeys. And not only then, when you have performed a long journey, stop at a racetrack and you get a solid, solid support when you perform the art of driving. Then it's all about removing the interior. It's a balance between force and technique. Here is a piece of the interior and I would like to show you these rubber plastic things that you might think is just there to protect the item but it is not. This is extremely important. This needs to be fitted because this makes the product solid when you fit it in the car, not shaking or scrambling when you're driving or perform the art of driving. Okay, let's continue to remove the interior. <laughs> I'm laughing at myself because uh, the idea I had when Competition Motorsport told me that they were going to send a roll cage was like, wow, I get a chance to do a video about how to fit a roll cage in your 718. But the manual that comes with the roll cage are so good that you don't need any further information. Thumbs up to Competition Motorsport. And with such perfect information that they give you, you know, don't hesitate to install it yourself. And as me that has done, performed a few, well, a lot of uh, things in the garage. It is such a pleasure. It's just relaxing, doing the work yourself, taking time to get to know your vehicle even better. Mm. For the first time, I run into challenge. I'm about to fit the rear kicker assembly. And uh, as you all know, I have the Alin Racing chassis fitted. And those looks a bit different towards the original. So I also have to remove this uh, side panel as well. And that is uh, not necessary if you're running stock. 
When the rear kicker assembly was fitted, it was time to start to fit the roll cage, and I realized more interior was needed to be removed. Pay attention to the sound composer that brings engine sound into the coupé. In the 718 you will find one, and in the 992 one more. Measuring, drilling and cutting, and finally I reached a point where I started to refit the interior. The roll cage is fitted. Let me put it this way. It took me much longer time than I expected. Well, it started out with a lot of speed to remove all the panels. That would done very quickly. The job started when I, you know, fitted the roll cage inside. Mm -hmm. But one perks by having a roll cage is that you continue your safety work with your vehicle, adding racing harnesses. In this case, Sparco and Radne Motor gave me this beautiful black racing harnesses that are FIA approved. Pay attention to the instruction because we're talking about your safety when you install them in your vehicle. I had one issue and it was all about the sub-belt mount that goes underneath the 918 bucket seats. Central Motorsport actually has made this product. What it does is it, you know, it fits underneath the 918 bucket seat and that's where you can mount the seat sub-belt mount. The perk with that is that it will you know, always have 10 to 20 degrees angles when you move the, the chair front and back. But it is a rubbery, actually this close to rubbery, two of these, one for the left and one for the right side, is $450 plus taxes. A bit expensive. Also, the installation guidance of these was rubbish. If you are listening, please take consideration to make a proper installation guide. Last but not least was to refit the bucket seats with the Sparco racing harnesses. that I have upgraded the safety level in my Cayman T. I think you should considering that when you do other upgrades to your vehicle. You tune your engine, brakes, uh, performance, chassis. I know from the first corner when I upgraded to Alin's Racing Road and Track that I needed to do something about the safety. Thank you Competition Motorsport for providing me with this roll cage. Thank you Radne Motor for providing me with these wonderful racing harnesses. Thank you for watching and if you have not already, hit that subscribe button. And if you are a subscriber, hit that bell button so you get notifications when I publish new videos. Perhaps this is, um, what is this? Is it a Cayman GTT? GTT, T, a lot of T, GTT. Hmm. I, just a club spot. Yes, Janko, you have stopped filming a long time ago. Why are you still sitting in your car and looking at it? Get out of the vehicle, Janko. But I love it! I love it! I want to move in! But you can't! This is just a vehicle! But I want to! Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I think they have, you know, medicines for people like me. It's a... Yeah, a lot of medicine. Actually, they need to, you know, develop new medicine to cure me, that's for sure. Oh, let's throw that drone up in the air.